an open box is constructed from a 36 centimeter by 36 centimeter square cardboard by cutting x centimeter squares from each corner and folding up the sides. We need to find the dimension of the box for maximum volume. We are also asking additional question that if the volume of the box is given as 3380 cubic centimeters, what will be the dimension? So first we take the cardboard which is 36 by 36. Now we are cutting the corners like this measure is x, this is also x and everywhere. Now you can easily understand the length of this portion will be the length of this one with 36 minus 2x and the length here is also will be 36 minus 2x. Now when you fold the corners after cutting the squares from the corners the box will look like this. So you can see that this length will be now 36 minus 2x, that will be 36 minus 2x and this height will be x. So the volume this can be written as x times 36 minus 2x, 36 minus 2x. So I'm typing my function which is x and then 36 minus 2x. So the term coming twice, so I keep it square. And now let us graph this one in the regular window and then adjust it. But you can easily see that the practical domain will give you x needs to be greater or equal to 0. And from here, 36 minus 2x needs to be greater or equal to 0, meaning is x should be lesser or equals 18. So that's our practical domain. So we say practical domain will be x is greater or equals 0, x is lesser or equals 18 coming from here. So plot the graph. First let's try with negative 10 to 25 and keep your y like this. Graph it. Okay, it is not that clear. So you can go to trace or you can go to zoom and then zero and see what happens. A little better. So we are looking for this portion here. So we can go to window one more time and adjust this window. So you can see it's too much for negative. We can reduce it to say 200. And then that one is this. Okay, let's look at the graph. So then we need to find this one max. Go to second, trace, maximum at four. Now move your pointer to the left side for the left bound, enter. Now move it to the right side for right bound, enter, then one more time. So now this one is giving you, you can say your x is 6 and volume is actually this one. So then we say that my x is 6 rounded to two decimal places and we'll write it. So when we are looking for dimension, so first I need to see the length 36 minus 2x, which is 36 minus 2 times 6. So then you get 36 minus 12, which is 24. So your dimension will be 24 centimeter by 24 centimeter by 6 centimeter. Second part, if the volume is given this, then we can just write here 3380 equals x times 36 minus 2x, 36 minus 2x. And we need to solve for x. We'll do this one in the calculator. So the second part now we put 33, sorry, 3380. So we plot the function. This is my volume function and that one was for 3380, you can see here. Now we see we have intersection in here, here, and that one. 
So that one is outside the domain. We need to find these two here. Go to second, trace, five is intersection. So first we stay left side of the graph, then it moves to the line, hit one more time. So it is giving you x equals five. So we write down x equals five, so that will give me volume equals 3380 cubic centimeter. Let us look at the next one. Go to second, trace, five is intersection, so you move other side. 059, I can approximate to 7.06. So we see that we can have 3380 cubic centimeter volume if x is 5 centimeter or 7.06 centimeter. But other one, if you see here, it will go outside the domain. Just have a look. Second, trace, 5 is intersection. Let's move there see what happens enter final that gives you 23.94 so if you plug here 23.94 this more than 36 so it will give me a negative answer so that's why we don't take that one thank you